Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's been a long time since I've filmed a video um, and as you guys know I went to England for a month and I've been back from England for over a month now so it's about time I film a video. Um, today I decided to do a Boots, Super Drug and Debenhams haul and I hope you guys enjoy. The first two things I got were these EOS balms and they're just like a little lip balm and you just open the lid and inside it's got a dome shaped balm. I really love these because they're really easy to use and I don't really like the ones where you have to put your finger in the balm and then put it on. I like the fact that you can just take the lid off and just whack it on. And Michaela had got one of these for me before and I loved it so much that I decided to get two more. The next thing I got was this Real Techniques brush cleaning palette and I've been looking for one for a really long time and I was so glad to hear that they have released one so I grabbed that and I like that it's got um, three different types of textures. It's got ones for eye brushes, this one for um, sort of medium to small brushes and these, these ones up here for the larger brushes. So that's great for all different types of brushes and it also has this little hand thing that you can slide your hand in so you can hold on to it like that or put your hand in it that way whatever whatever you prefer and I like that it's also like got an edge around it so you basically fill it with warm water and you get your brush and which is this Real Techniques brush cleansing gel and I think it's really good because I've been searching for one that doesn't cost an arm and a leg and this one is perfectly affordable which is amazing and it has this amazing scent guys like oh like you want your brushes to smell like this seriously because all the other ones that I've used they're not really they don't really smell very good they just kind of smell like chemicals where this one smells so good when you when you put your brushes on your face you can smell the scent and it's like oh it's like you want to wash your brushes even more because you just want to smell that beautiful ah beautiful scent it is amazing and it cleans them really well and with these two together it's a perfect combo so I think it's great, like you pour a dollop of this in the palette, get a little bit of warm water, swish your brush around and you've got a clean brush and it smells really nice. So unfortunately you cannot get these in Australia at the moment as I'm aware of, but they should be coming out fairly soon. So keep an eye out for these because you really need them, like I swear on my life you need these in your life. Oh, no more like, you know, sticky foundation brushes that because like sometimes you get soap and you try and clean them and it doesn't really do a lot. Like you find that sometimes the foundation's still stuck in your brush and it's just like a whole nightmare. But this, this is what you need. This and this and this. Just get it, please. Do it for me. Do it for me. That'd be really nice. Also, while I was in Boots, I got some Zoella products and the first thing I got was the Zoella Wonder Hand Moisturizing Hand Cream. And I really love this stuff because it smells really amazing. Like it smells exactly like all the original scent, which is the peach smell. And it's really good for moisturizing your hands, obviously. And yeah, I really love this and I love the packaging. I think it's really cute. And yeah, I love it. Ow, just stabbed myself in the eye. <laughs> Next, I picked up the Zoella fragrance called Let's Spritz. And this is from her second range, which is the Tutti Fruity collection. And I really love the smell of this. I'd have to say it's like my favourite scent of hers so far. I can't really describe it, it's like, it's really nice scent, like it's not the typical tutti frutti scent that you probably imagine that it would be, it's actually quite a nice, I really can't describe it, it's just something that you have to go and smell yourself, but I really love this, this is my favourite scent so far. Also from Zoella Beauty I picked up this body fondant, and basically what it is, you open it up and inside it's got a little powder puff and you just swirl it around and it's just like in a cream sort of consistency. Swirl it around and you apply it to your skin and it gives you a nice brown shimmery glow. <laughs> also while I was there I grabbed three Zoella candles from her new um, Zoella Lifestyle range and these are amazing. This is the first one, it's called Gingerbread Village and I really love how she's packaged these because they have like a cute little box and you open it up. I'll show you one I've already opened. For example, this is the Lazy Days candle and the box, you just open it up and I think it's really cool and then the candle's just sitting in the middle and each one has like a different picture that matches the candle. But yeah, as I was saying, this is the Gingerbread Village and as you can imagine, it smells like amazing gingerbread men and I think this is great for Christmas time because this is obviously a Christmas scent and I can't wait to use it. Ah, oh, it smells so good. It smells so good like Christmas. 
and this one here is just called the Lazy Days Candle and it just smells like um, linen sheets and cotton and I think this one is really really nice it's something simple and it's one that everyone will like the last candle I got from her was the Seaside Stroll Candle and this one smells really nice it smells like the beach obviously that's why it's called Seaside Stroll um, I actually show you what the candles look like because I haven't really shown you and as I said with the packaging it's really cool I love how the candle just like pops out and this one's got this is what the candle looks like it's just a nice they're all like the same they all have like a nice sort of classic look the next thing I got from Boots was the Tanya Burt Perfect Brows Kit and inside it has three different eyebrow colours and this one is perfect because this is the best blonde shade I've probably seen because as you guys will probably know if you're blonde as well um, trying to find this like that perfect blonde shade that isn't too dark or isn't too light is really hard to find and I think this is really great so I'm using that a lot at the moment and it just has hot cocoa oh no hot, hot cocoa and chestnut so they're great if you have uh, brown hair or you know they're great if you're a brunette, you know what I'm saying? And this one right here is a great uh, brow bone highlight. And I like how it comes with a little brush and a little, a little, what's it called? A tweezer. A tweezer. It's not a tweezer. Tweezers. So, and as you guys can see, the mirror is sadly smashed in little pieces because when I put it in my suitcase, Oh, I cried a million cries, honestly. I was so sad because I love this because it has a mirror and it broke. But you can't have everything in life. I also got the collection concealers and these are absolutely amazing. The best concealers I've ever used. Um, I did get one of these last time I went to England which was about like four years ago. Um, and I love them still just as much as I did back then. Um, I got one in fair which is great for if I am... Um, when I don't have a fake tan or when I do have a fake tan this is a great shade to highlight under my eyes. And also I picked up the warm medium shade which is good for covering any blemishes when I have a fake tan. So these are perfect. And the funny thing is about these that they're like perfect shades which is insane. Like I just randomly picked up the, the medium colour and that matches my fake tan like almost perfectly. And same with this one matching my fair skin. So these have a great colour selection and they just are so good. But the sad part is you can't get these in Australia but I do know that I think you can order them on eBay so get them in bulk and then like stock up on these because they're so good when I went into Debenhams I got a bunch of different goodies um, the first thing I got was the Too Faced Totally Cute palette and the thing I love about this is that you get to decorate it with stickers like they have a bunch of sticker sheets that come in the box and you can just customize your own palette to look however you want it to which I think is pretty cool like decorating your own palette like this is goals um, as you can see I've decorated mine already and the colours inside are really cute, or obviously, super cute palette. Um, my favourite one has definitely got to be this one here, which is Shooting Star. I think this is an amazing colour. I'll just show you a little swatch. Uh, I don't think you can really... Oh, yeah. Look at that. Like, look how good that looks. It's actually like a shooting star. Look at it. It goes... It's amazing. But I really love the colours in this. Although at first glance I was like, oh, the pink, the green and the blue, I'm like, am I going to really use these? But funny enough, I find them to be, when you actually put them on your eyes, they're actually not as strong as they look. Like the bright colours, they're not quite as intense. But they're still like a nice pop of colour that you can sort of accent with these more neutral tones. So I've actually really enjoyed experimenting with this palette, so always happy to try something new. Next I got something from The Balm and that was the Maniza Sisters and I've never gotten anything from The Balm before so I thought it was about time. It comes with all three of the Luminizers and as you can see it is amazing. It comes with the Mary Luminizer, the Cindy Luminizer and the Betty Luminizer and these are amazing. Like This one I tend to use as a blush, like a highlighting blush and this one as a highlighting bronzer and this one Ooh, like is on fleek you need it like it's so good oh it's life guys like it actually is life it's like it will make your all your highlighting dreams come true so I recommend this one because you can actually get all three of these separately but I wanted to just try them all and so far I've had a lot of success with them so very happy about that one 
Also for first, I got the Benefit Roller Lash and now I've been wanting this for the longest time and I've been putting it off going, oh, should I buy it? Is it worth it? Like, it's a lot of money. But I'm so glad I did. It's the best thing I've ever bought. And it's amazing and I love it and I'm so glad. I mean, it's worth every single dollar. I recommend this if you're interested in a high-end mascara. The next thing I got was the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Foundation and I got it in the shade R210. And I'm so glad I found this because I've been searching for a fair foundation for the longest time and I've finally found one that really matches really well. And I also really love this because it has a great coverage. I'd say it's probably a medium buildable coverage. And yeah, I have nothing bad to say about this so I recommend trying these out. I also went into Topshop and just had a look at their makeup as well and I got a highlighter called uh, Mother of Pearl and I think this one is so pretty like it has like this iridescent sort of like um, purple shimmer within it it's really hard to explain like it looks like a um, sort of a golden type highlighter until you start to move around you can probably see there's like that purple reflect in it which I think is really cool for maybe going on a night out so I'm really looking forward to trying this one out and seeing how I go with it but I loved it so much like the colour is actually so pretty especially when you do like a little swatch it's like so oh it's to die for recommend you checking that one out because it's too good not to buy and I also got um, an eyeshadow um, called Wax and Wayne and this one is also iridescent as you can see it's got like purple and blue sort of flecks in it as well and it's kind of similar to the highlighter but I'd say it's more on the purple side as you can see all the rainbowy sort of colours in it and I think this one as well for clubbing for going nights out it's going to be a killer it's going to be whew, eyeshadow is going to be oh, on fleek on the dance floor I'm just saying I'm just saying I got a Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick in the colour Feeling Myself and I haven't had any of the matte ones yet so I was really eager to try it and I absolutely love this colour, it's really pretty orangey coral colour. Um, the formula though is I'm kind of a little bit undecided about it, like I, I think sometimes it can wear really well but other times not so well, like I've had some problems where I feel like it kind of can melt off my lips a little bit which is kind of weird because I really really loved um, the original formula for the um, for the original melted range but for some reason I'm not as madly in love with this actual formula so I'm a little bit disappointed but I still think I'm gonna get a lot of wear of this out of this one because I love it so much anyway but yeah just a shame about it really because I had high expectations and I don't know maybe I'm just I don't know, maybe there's something else I could do to make this last longer, but yeah, it just melted off a little bit and sort of didn't stay put, so you know what I'm saying? Next I went to Victoria's Secret and I got these body mists, and the first one I got was Temptation, and this one smells like really nice and fruity, and this one is Aqua Kiss, which I reckon smells like a bit of a sea mist, so I love these. I think, I think Victoria's Secret body mists are really great because Sometimes you don't want to waste your like expensive perfume on like a regular basis. So if you're just going to the gym or you're just chilling out with friends, you don't really want to go crazy with the perfume. These are great because they're good value and they smell nice and people want to eat you because they're so good. Like, oh, oh. I have another one called Seduction and that one is to die for. It smells like the best fruit you've ever smelled in your life and Oh, I'm just, I can't even, these these things are the best, you need some, get some, go to Victoria's Secret, buy them, buy them, it turns you into this amazing smelly fruit goddess and you can't go wrong with that, I mean, you know, like, look at them, look at them, you know what I'm saying? I also picked up this Tanya Burr Cosmetics 12 Days of Christmas Beauty Calendar and I think this is amazing because, I mean, come on guys, it's got beauty beauty stuff in it like who doesn't want that in like their beauty like advent calendar for Christmas I mean it can't get better than this seriously and the great thing is about it is the price like it's really affordable and you get like so much makeup it's so good you know oh, I need that the last couple of things aren't beauty items but I thought I'd show you anyway and one of them is the Tanya Bakes book which is a baking book by Tanya Burr and I love this because it has amazing recipes in it like the best 
baking recipes of your life in this book and whew, like I'm not really into cooking books and all that sort of thing but this one is baking and it has sweet treats and everything in the whole world that you could ever want that's cookies, treats, cakes, everything in this and I really love the cover like look at it it's so beautiful and I think everyone needs a hard cover a hard cover baking book in their life you know it's just important I think this one this one this one is great so nothing more to say about it than that I think I'm gonna calm down now because I'm going a little bit insane the next thing I got was from the Zoella lifestyle range and that is this little organizer and it says she designed a life she loved and the thing I like about it the most is that a it's got rose gold on the writing and it's got grey and I like this little peachy tone here I think this is actually perfect like I've been looking for one for a really long time um, and this is literally everything I could ever want and I like it because when you open it up it's got oh I can't show you what this is because it's got a list of all my YouTube videos I want to film but it has like a little uh, hang on let me take that off for a second we'll hide that so it has a this side is just has the days of the week and you can say what you're doing on them and there's a few different sticky notes with marble print on it and I love that and this one just is for notes, plans, what are that, all that sort of thing and I like it because you can peel them off which I think is great so that is a definitely a perfect organizer in my eyes like you can't get better than that honestly like marble, rose gold, peach, oof, oof, oof and grey, oh girlfriend that Oh. so that was my England beauty haul I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, please give it a thumbs up if you did and I'll see you guys next time bye I love a good contour when it's like it's just oh, I'm proud of myself I'm proud of myself <laughs>